Yo, what's up everyone? It's your boy Karis my playing Kha'Zix cause uh the other uh like one Kane stole Kane from me. So Kha'Zix is uh he's, I wouldn't say he's really that good in the Kane. I think the best champs to play in the Kane is Graves, Kindred, and a really good Nidalee. Rengar as well. Those are the ones I struggle among struggle against the most in Challenger. In lower elos, I'd say the worst is like Udir, maybe Warwick, uh, stuff like that. Lower elos, those are like the most annoying. But Kha'Zix is like a solid pick because you have your invis. So it, if you have a lot of mobility and you can dodge out his Ws, it's pretty good. Uh, you can be pretty strong early game. You gotta make sure your pathing's on par. I think the best way to path against the can is to, con is to control bolt scuttles. So that's what we're gonna try and do. We're gonna try and be super secretive with our pathing as well. They have Tyler one playing aftershock Quinn. Interesting. Chance I could make a YouTube video talking about your common early game pathings on Kane. That's like all my videos. By the way, guys, I'm streaming right now. If you're interested, check out my Twitch. Twitch TV Karis will be in the description below. Also, I'm a part of a huge giveaway. Be checking the description down below. It's a bunch of YouTubers, $600 worth of RP or dollars, just in general. Uh, all you have to do is just sub to a couple people on YouTube. Maybe, maybe uh, like some things on Twitter. It's really easy and it's really free. It's for the holidays. Me and a bunch of other huge YouTubers are getting in on that. It's it's, it's amazing. So, be sure to check that out. Yo, Pod764, thanks so much for the Twitch Prime. So, appreciate that so I appreciate that so much, homie. Alright, let's get right yeah. into the game. Uh, so, we're against Kan. He has precision secondary dark card. Okay, yeah, that's like the pretty much the standard runes for right now. People hate my phase rush and conquer vids, but it's situational. They don't understand that. I think Dark Harvest is currently the best, but it's getting nerfed, so I'll probably make a no what run to run. Dark Harvest nerfs. So this is like a different pathing I've picked up on Kha'Zix. It's a good way of controlling both scuttles and being very aggro early on. So if Kane tries to fight me or anything, I can easily just uh, take him out. I'm gonna try and go for a good gank here. Oh, he kind of backed off there. I think, wait, what? Yeah, that's pretty good, I think. Didn't have his blue either. We started red. Yeah. That's a pretty good start. Really well played by Huhi. That's who my mid laner is, if you guys are curious. Sorry, I didn't really show anyone on my team. It's Huhi and Scrandor, well known Blitz, Blitz man. Yeah, that's too That's a pretty good start, I think. I'm gonna farm this camp in base. I right, like my and longsword maybe. I usually like to go red smite against champs like Kane on Kha'Zix. Normally I go blue, but red smite's pretty legit to be honest. Most sometimes. It just helps to make sure that he knows he can never fight you. Oh, whoops! Like quick enough. Okay, sweet. I didn't lose my top side. See, there is like a small possibility that you would just run to my top side and like take the camps there. I think I'm gonna farm Raptors and then run to the scuttle. I want to be efficient and control every scuttle. 
Because as a stronger early game Jong, that's pretty much what you do to beat Cans. Be curious. So it should respawn in like 20 seconds. I have time to farm my Gromp and then go to it. Yeah. Cans top side. I don't know why I showed himself. Can you even take my Gromp? Yeah, I was thinking that like, there's no way I could have taken my Gromp, right? Maybe Solo right there, but it doesn't really matter. Nah. I'm just gonna do this. Because Kane could be around. I want to save my smite with my Q, so I'll just, I'll just hold on to it and then... Oof! Ify, boys. Hopper shove this wave. Okay, oh, yeah, that should be good. Now I'll have a Warhammer. So, like I mentioned, well, as you guys saw, I took uh, Kane and Syndra's flash early on. So them having no flash means that I could just rush damage. I don't really need to get boots. Because if I path properly, I should be everywhere I need to be on the map. So I just keep farming efficiently and keep properly placing myself. This is flash and this is control worded, so this is definitely a good opportunity to gank. If he gets counter ganked, it's gonna be a bit risky because Brand, but you just wasted one of his main abilities, so. I really would keep it here. Okay, yeah, nice. Yeah, that's like as much as I could do. You got a lot of orbs off that, that's the thing that kind of stinks. Shouldn't have his form though, I don't think. Good. Alright, so. I'm gonna look to get six and then probably uh, look for another play and then try and get objectives. I wanna take Rift as soon as possible in these type of scenarios. That, uh, that Quinn is so tanky with Aftershock, Tyler. Actually, sorry to kill that guy. Ollie's going to the enemy's John. Yeah. I'm pretty big now. I might get solo there. It's a pretty dangerous scenario. Yeah. Kinda sucks. I have no smite, so this is kind of risky, but I feel like I can easily kill Can if he comes. I have 4 out of 5 Ravnus on her stack, so my fighting stats are just insane right now. Having Jung item and everything. Did Blitzcrank to step up there. Pretty sure Can's going to be around there. That's 100%. Syndra. Yeah, 
would have liked, loved to have taken that Gromp, but I, I had to watch out for Syndra. He's gonna farm these two camps to go do Rift. I get Lethality because their team's super squishy, so. Lethality, it'd be so huge. Probably go like Dustblade and then maybe Black Cleaver after. Get a control word before I go to Rift. Alrighty. Oh, did Top get soloed? Oh no, Top got a one for one. That's pretty good actually. Not that she got soloed or something. And he's gonna try and get his red form, so I have a feeling he's gonna try and like fight. I. Midliner right now, so I'm gonna be here just in case. No, he's not. It's like a really risky call. Slash idea. Oh, I missed path, I think. Yeah, I'm gonna run straight up, I think. The only way they can can come to me is crossing the wall. I think he's trying to sit behind top and counter gank right now. So I'm just like trying to prioritize Rift while they waste their time trying to try to do that. Nice. Okay, well that's, that's good. I don't know if you guys read this, but the new patch, there's the, having one of a dragon, like one ocean, one cloud, is actually really good now. So I think taking junglers that are good at taking dragons early, such as Kha'Zix, I think can really excel in this meta. Dark Harvest is getting nerfed next patch, so I might try out Electrocute, but I mean, I think Dark Harvest will still be Good, but I don't know how good. I'll try out Electric just to see like which I'd prefer. Probably still would prefer Dark Har uh, Dark Harvest to be honest. What? Wait, I got a hundred to zero. That's crazy. I really was not expecting that. That's tragic. Just got two free kills and probably out his form. Ah, it's gonna be rough. They actually get Akali ahead. Or like try and keep her ahead. Making a big mistake trying to help out mid. Tinder is just I mean, I don't know. I think rushing sword boot shouldn't be like a legit way of playing.
got the tower. That's pretty good. I'd imagine Kane to just keep going bot. Especially now that he has his form. Doesn't need to stay anywhere in specific. Yeah, they got a cloud. That's unlucky. At least I have dust blade soon. That'll be good. Her mid is just too good. I ain't gonna come on, right? Uh, was it really warden? It sucks. So I want. Oh, I guess I can get Tabby. Now I get Hex Shrinker than a Black Cleaver. Oh my goodness. That was insane. Okay, I think Kane's gonna come try and dive him. I hit him with the W should be done. I don't mind. It's going bot. Buff. Our carvest. Oh, that sucks. And get that, uh, Brad. Play against Charismized Graves. I think that guy's. Oh, Ace Graves. Reaper, thanks so much for the Twitch Prime stuff. Appreciate that so much, man. I, oh, I loved you, buddy. Cinder damage. So insane, man. Yeah, I feel like Kane's pathing is just too obvious. I think I need blues. Okay. 
like three and one. Let's see. Where's my item? Get that for now. One of those. Wait. Two of these. All right. Sweet. So now I just need a black cleaver. Then I'll get G after. I'll be huge. Oh wait, no, I should get an executioner. I'll get black cleaver executioner. Don't need GA. I play good enough. We have very good Baron with Kha'Zix as well. Kha'Zix is so good for all objectives, I think. Yeah, there's no way they would expect this, I don't think. Unless they were watching my stream. Oh, they're all coming. Yeah, one shot me anymore, guys. That's why I got a hex shrinker. They just walk in his face. See how easy it is? Just do this. Hey, want to reset? I have black cleaver in uh, like 300 gold. Hi, Shanghai. So I'm just gonna farm uh, farm these Krugs and we should be good. There you go. Now I just need Executioner. Finish that into a mortal reminder will be huge if you want to see my damage so far. Good. 364. Yeah, not bad, honestly. See, people always tell me how Kane's broken, but anytime I play against a Kane, like, I've never seen a Kane in this region, like, impress me or, like, understand how to play the champion. Cause there's like a certain playstyle you need for like each specific scenario, I think. And yeah, I don't know. I think this guy's like a 900 LP challenger, Kane man. People always ask me what I think about him. Or he's like 700 LP now or whatever. Yeah, people always ask me what I think about him. I don't think too much. Yeah, I, I decided to neutralize the split pressure. So, well guys, if you ever want to learn how to beat a cane, I mean, you can do it with any champion to be honest. It's all about early, it's about impacting lanes and taking scuttle control. This cane is too weak of a champion to like take scuttles from any jungler. So any jungle in the game could beat a cane really easy. Honestly, God, I don't want to give away too many secrets because obviously people would use them against me. But if you know what you're doing against a cane, you can always beat him like this. 
Always. I suppose it's like that with a lot of champions though, right? I got know my friend Chase Shaco. Tells me about how there's certain ways you can beat Shaco. Oh, I couldn't smite it quick enough. Dang, that sucks. That guy's really tanky. That's because I have no executioner. See, maybe I should have got executioner early on. Hey, you killed Quinn? Oh, it must have been the bouncing, uh. Oh, it was the trap. Wait, he hooked her onto the trap. That blitz cranks 100 IQ. Or 100, 200? I don't know, what's high IQ? I've never taken an IQ test. You can take whatever they want, I don't really care. The thing is, is that a lot of people probably wonder why I didn't jump in on like Quinn or whatever, or but not. It's like Quinn has aftershock. You just have it. Do a lot of damage, but it's from isolation. So if she's not isolated, it's with all the defensive stats. Like people always it, it, you, see with every champ, you need to understand the champ's design and kit. Kha'Zix isn't really that strong in team fights. I remember a while ago they nerfed his like Q base damage from not being in isolation. And that was for a good reason, because he's like a champion that plays off like isolated moments. He's not like a champ that is supposed to be super strong in like scenarios where you can just he, he shouldn't be like a good fighter champ, I don't know. I like how he is. And if you guys understand how to play that, then Kha'Zix is a pretty cool champ. Both that hit me. I'll just do Baron for free. I think I'll just get Motor Reminder reset. Alrighty. Yeah, it's just too easy. I don't know. This build's pretty bad too. I want to go Sterics Gage into our comp. Uh -uh. I would have just went Merc Treads because, man. Actually, no, no, I wouldn't have went Merc Treads. But I went full damage. There's no other way to play against Kha'Zix. You need to go like full damage. Death stance and stuff. Oh lord. Who he? Who is he? Okay, it's Porny. Don't be at me for that one. Porny comment. Oh lord, yeah. Alright, well, hope you guys enjoyed the video. Be sure to check out the giveaway. Be sure to check out the Twitch link, everything. Much love to you guys. Have a good day.